Hooray! We're going to cover two great sounds today. T and D. T and D. T. First, let's talk about this great sound. T. T. So just like P, P, which I recently spoke about, T, T, T requires a lot of air. T, T. Can you feel that air? That's what a lot of people miss when they're trying to make this sound. T, with air. T, T, T. And in terms of our tongue, T, T. It just goes like this, to the front of our mouth. T, 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 T. So that's pretty cool. And, uh, yeah, thinking of some great words with T, what about time or Tom, like a good friend of mine, or tomorrow, for example. So there's lots, lots of different, different words you can use. And let's try now D, D. Can you feel the difference? T and D, D. This time, the mouth position and tongue position is quite similar. T, D, D. But this time, you add voice, vibration. Uh, D, D, uh, D, D. T, T, T. T, there is no voice. So that's how you know the difference between the two sounds. D, D. Classic word with D is dog, or maybe something's really miserable, doom, or if you're feeling really pessimistic, no, we're all doomed. So this has been T and D. Um, if you have any thoughts about these sounds or any particular difficulties, write below. And, yeah, I look forward to hearing from you. And, great. This has been Charles Wood, English teacher. Your language tutor online. Ha ha ha. Ha 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 ha. It's not that funny, really. <laughs>